You've got to tune to KEXP. We're listener-powered radio at 90.3 FM here in Seattle. You can find us online around the world at KEXP.org. I'm Cheryl Waters. Our good friend Elvis Perkins is back in the studio. Welcome. Thank you, dear. It's great to be back. It is so wonderful to see you and so excited to see a new album from you, I Obeyed. Are you going to play songs from that today? We sure are. All right. Why don't you kick us off with a couple of tunes? All right. Here is a song called I Came for Fire. And it sounds like this. turn up like midnight like the edge of town of all the loose matches I'll move among the farm in fact they will call me sire as I rise to the crown I came for fire a stick up a cake
beautiful. It's Elvis Perkins live on KEXP. Can we have a little bit more guitar in the mix, please? Hello, Seattle. How do you do? We're going to keep it dark for a minute, then we'll make our way into the light. This is a song called The Passage of the Black Gene. It's a true story that sounds like this. Master gone Looking up and in To a light across the road She froze for a moment And then moved on Da-da-da 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 When I came to where she'd been I looked around for a mirror And found in its place a billboard Beaming down a model In the echo of her body Selling, no yelling, yelling the black And looking up and in To the light across the road I froze for a moment and then moved on
It's Elvis Perkins live here in the KEXP studios. That was absolutely mesmerizing. Thank so, you, Sharon. So wonderful to have you here. We've had you on air many times in all kinds of uh, setups. We very first had you solo the very first time, and then uh, with various folks, practically a hoot nanny. Dr. Dog and the Cold War Kids. Absolutely. That was a dream. That was fantastic you always seem to surround yourself with talented and interesting people and uh, from what I'm seeing and hearing today uh, these two are no exception can you introduce your absolutely band this is Danielle Aykroyd on the bass guitar and the harmonium and the auto harp and sundry other effects uh, and on the space station over here we have mr. Mitchell robe he's playing the mini Moog the Mellotron uh, and the Swarmatron that doesn't have anything to do with bees does it um, it should have more to do with bees than it does, but it's got a little bit to do with bees, inspired sh surely by bees. Um, it's a very high, uh, highly advanced synthesizer that we are using as a kick drum. Oh, how clever. <laughs> Uh, th those are just some of the instruments that are being played um, and exhibited today. I highly recommend people follow up and watch the companion video that ah, we'll have yes, for this they session. Must. And you all look fantastic, by the way. <laughs> Thank you. Elvis, uh, it's been a long time since we've seen you. It seemed like we were seeing you a ton for a while, and uh, then you've gone off to uh, do what? Oh, I went off into um, some sort of solar hibernation and uh, mostly to produce uh, this new record, I Obeyed. Um, which I uh, recorded, engineered, wrote, performed the vast majority of. Um, so it took a long while to figure out how to do that, and then I tinkered and edited for quite a long while as well. So, From what I've heard about it, it sounds like a journey, very literally and figuratively as well. Can you talk about kind of how you... Uh, the spaces that you were in when you were writing and recording this? Yeah, I mean, uh, for the most part, I, I did work at home in uh, the Hudson Valley. Um, and then at a certain point, um, there was call for a cross-country journey, and I decided to take my rig with me and recorded in hotel rooms across the country at friends' places um, all, over the, all over the country, mostly on the West Coast, and um, ended up working for a while in a mobile home, which was... Uh, issuing these wonderful um, uh, ecstatic, static, uh, oscillating uh, AM frequencies, and I uh, ended up sampling some pieces of classical music from the same mobile home. So in one of the songs, we've got uh, Aaron Copeland's Appalachian Spring winding itself in and out, um, and a couple other samples uh, in the record. So uh, it was a, the whole record was a very experimental um, odyssey of a, uh, of a thing, and it was a lot of fun. and. Uh, took a long while to see through. Was that process because you wanted to travel to see these people, to work with these people? You just felt like going on a road trip and you didn't want to stop working on the record? Um, yeah, a combination of all of those things. Like, uh, I'm proud to have um, the first and I believe only overdub from Frank Fairfield. Do you know Frank's music? We do, yeah. yes. Um, so I, I sought him out. He was in Los Angeles and I took my gear over to his place and um, recorded him and that was a lot of fun and uh, um, so yeah the the mission um, it didn't need to be taken but uh, it sounded like the right idea at the moment and uh, and it certainly sounded like a lot of fun it was indeed and uh, are you all I know you played last night here in Seattle are, are you all out on the road for a while or what are your plans um, actually this uh, last night at the triple door which was fantastic um, was our last show of a five-week US stint um, I believe the Deerland record, we started in Seattle, so it's a nice loop to end here. Um, we have a few days off, then we're going to Spain, and we're going to uh, France, and we're going to Brussels. Oh, not a bad job if not you can get bad, it. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone looks excited. Well, we're, we are so lucky to have you, and you've been uh, together five weeks playing, and you're at your prime. You sound fantastic. We're so excited to have you here. You got a couple more tunes for us? We sure do. It's Elvis Perkins, live on KEXP. This is a song about putting your dollar in the right place. It's called My Two Dollar Bill. It sounds like this. My friends, the presidents, I pass away. Haunt all corners of my current state. In no clearer man of my living will 
This is my two dollar bill I feel it far less matters who I'll vote for Than the thing I put the dollar toward For I know by now they factory farm the hill This is my two dollar bill This is my two dollar bill Zing, clinkins turned round Jefferson's to Roosevelt's in time Pass on any to a bad man You aid and abet the crime Can a Washington redeem a Jefferson Withholding, yes, and with care putting in They will double their meanings, oh I know they will When we say so long Coca-Cola Look what you have done in Colombia and India, etc., etc., set free my winged Nike and all the little slaves who kept her company. And when we cut off those Monsantos of this world who must not give a bleep who'd shoot their own ma for a buck my friends do add amendments to this bill of mine if I come to your town somewhere down the line I would gladly pass on the mic as a feather quill to sign the two dollar bill. Say, this is my two dollar bill. This is my Elvis Perkins live on KEXP, the new album I Obeyed. Elvis, is this out on your own record label? It is out on my own record label, yeah. It's called Mirror Records and uh, distributed with the help of the good people at In Grooves in uh, California. And uh, yeah. And available now? And available, yes. Uh, you can get it on LP, you can get it on the digital form, obviously, CD, and uh, we're even traveling with some cassette tapes. Oh. So next time we're out, look out for those. <coughs> Shall we do one more song from this thing? We'd love it. Cool. receives the heart of a hog and undergoes spiritual transformation. It's called Hogus Pogus. Say, you are a much nicer person since the hog's heart was inserted in you. Say how it is now with your new life. Well, 
There's no more aching or heart breaking. There's no more baking for me. I am a much happier person when I bed down and down to earth, and oh, I highly recommend it to thee. You'll have no more crying, no more sighing, no more lying from me. You see, I was once pig-headed. Now I love to be petted in the mud, to be bedded by thee. I am more in my body, and with it more and less naughty, I think I'll finally write that biography. It will read oh so much aching. There was oh so much baking. It was the massive coronary which opened my eyes to see no more crying, no more denying, no more complying for me. I have much more feeling. I do much more squealing, more reeling in the great mystery. In fact, I found. In my own body, yes, I found my true love. My dog he put it in me. Yes, I found my true love. Yes, in. And it was me. Na 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 na. Oh oh Say, you are a much nicer person since the hog's heart was inserted in you. Oh, say how it is now with your new life. Well, there is no more crying, no deep sighing, no deep frying of all for. Smiles all around on that one. Elvis Perkins live on KEXP. I obeyed the new album. Elvis, it's so great to see you. Thank you so much, Cheryl, for having us. It's been a blast. Thank you all for coming in today. You've got to tune to KEXP Seattle. Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.